What's up you guys? Joker back. Today I'm going to show you one of my chest rigs that I've used in my first video but it's got a lot of new things on it. So we're gonna walk this through. This whole chest rig is made out of spare parts or extra parts that you get uh, to the Swedish Combat Vest 2000. So you can upgrade it and make it into a chest rig instead of a combat vest. Uh, now this is very popular in the Swedish Armed Forces uh, because the vest has a lot of tendencies to be a little bit too loose or not very good in, in the field unless you use it very much right. So a lot of people have chosen to use this rig but they uh, modify it after their own picking so to say. So what we got here is open mag pockets from um, a Swedish company called Snigel Design. And uh, this is a multi-purpose pouch from the Swedish Armed Forces that you get. Medic pouch, also from Snigel Design. Admin pouch. Grenade pouch. With a cat tourniquet in it. And... Uh, 5.56 mags in it so this is the front and I'll show you the back of it too alright so this is the back of the chest rig uh, this here is a belt part itself with like I said in the previous first video I ever made with an old Swedish Mali system but we did this that we put in a belt this is an old combat belt for a very much older uh, chest rig system used in the 80s in the Swedish Armed Forces. So we put this in here instead of using Velcro. So this is how you tighten it up. Get it in here. And this is the yoke parts. It's got molly here. So it's much more modern. That's why a lot of uh, soldiers are choosing to use it because the older system was a bit outdated here's the back of the admin pouch so uh, this was just a quick overview of this one and next video I'll make I'll make sure to use this one on me so you get to see it subscribe like comment everything keep it up you guys choker out